Hey folks, I'm Philippi and welcome back to Dredge. In the last episode, we sunk our ship. But, good thing we can save from the last save point, which is where I slept over here at this traveling merchant's place. The Dusty Pontoon. So we'll head back out in the waters and try and collect some more materials. I only need a few more uh, to get what I need. In fact, I should go to the floating dock and see what I need now. I know I need... need a total... One. I still need three wood. I still need one glass, which is what I think that last thing is. I need one, two, three metals. I lost one to a fish in the last episode, which is unfortunate. We'll try and get some more. Let me get that new hull going and finally get some freaking space, which would be so nice. Because the space we have now is so minuscule that I find it kind of annoying. Alright, let's head off. And, uh, whoa, camera did a lot of weird stuff right there. And we'll go and look for some spots where I can get some materials. Oh, there is a ship here, so let's do that. What is this? I'm playing uh, video games in the 90s has really taught me uh, how to deal with uh, those kind of situations. That kind of mini game there. Aw. Oh. A wreck fish. Interesting. Let's catch another one of those. Oh! That's all I can catch with that. Leave this. I think this pot was depleted anyhow. It's the same here. No, this is that salmon that we caught last episode, but lost because we sunk our ship. I can catch at least two of these. In fact, I can catch three of them. I'm a little worried about getting sunk by that fish again, so we're going this and we're going to head back to dock. Well, over here. I should turn on my flashlight. Oh, there is something out there that looks like it wants to be captured, so maybe we'll do that too. Alright. Fish market. Sell the fish. So let's stick this in storage. And I'm going to risk it and head out. Just over here. Right here. I heard the monster. Oh, thank you. Let's sell those as well. Excellent. I wonder if we can sneak out. Let's rest a little bit. Okay. That ball's gone away. Let's see if we can sneak out and grab something in the... here. Looking for those uh, eels. Oh, no, no, no. Oh, no, thank you. We're heading back. We're 
heading back. I don't want to sink again. I've been good. What's this port here? An old man emerges from one of the nearby broken buildings and hobbles towards you. Oh, and greetings. Don't get many visitors around here. What is it you need? This place doesn't seem safe. Why do you live here? Hi, I've been stubbornly holding out here for quite some time. Truth be told, I've been reconsidering my position lately. I've been happy here for so long. My wife and I had such a beautiful life until the collapse. Oh. And now I'm alone, cut off from the land and the sea. Left only with these trembling rocks on all sides. I can help you move. It's not that simple. My brother would never, you see. I used to live in Inkfell with my brother. He was a whaler back in the day. Things were bad. We fought a lot. Mostly about how our parents' inheritance should be divided. We were in the prime foolishness of our youth. When my wife and I decided to move here, I took the family crest and stole it from him. Now, after all this time, I can't return without it. Well, where is it? Where is the problem? After the collapse, that creature that dragged debris from the houses were down into the wretched burrows. The crest went down with it. It's all lost, because I know... It's a lost cause, I know, but if you were to find it, it would be a large whalebone crest. It would mean the world to me. I'll look for it. Thank you, but please be careful. Excellent. I have four research points. Still not quite sure what to do with them yet. gonna wait. Let's uh, undock and let's head over and get some healing. Should be daytime now so they shouldn't be coming after me. continue to uh, look for scrap and stuff. Should be okay now. This is daytime. Those are just regular fish here, I believe. Yeah, well, there's a new fish for me. Very unfortunate shape, and I'm not going to continue to catch the rest of you because I don't have any room. Continue to look around. Oh, there's some wood here. Perfect. Uh, do I need wood? I do. Let's grab some. Grab at least two. They have three here. I might consider grabbing the three. Maybe three here. But I need to get all the upgrades. I'm gonna make um, storage a little funky though. Maybe I can rearrange the storage to be slightly nicer. That would be nicer. I think. Still not great though. There we go. Now I can fit a, at least one scrap in. There's a ship right here, so let's take a look at that. 
This is jewelry. It's a silver trinket. Okay, no problem. And then there was some more scrap over here. It's a cloth, which I don't need. And more scrap over here. Here we go. This is what I need. As soon as I get this, we're going to head right back to base because I don't want to get caught in here. On our way back. Okay, I'm going to go on the outside. We hit a bit of a graphical bug. Oh, there's the eyeball. I was to say, because the eyeball's not showing up. There it is there. Let's head into dock. Uh, we can um, float in dock here. I can definitely get this upgrade now. I can only grab one of them. That's unfortunate. Let's take the rest in here. That in there. Need one more of these. Let's back off and sell the one fish. Uh, let's snooze until close to morning. Not exactly morning, and then I'm gonna head out. I'm gonna see if I can get the uh, eels very fast. No, not the eels. That is scary. We're not gonna do it here there. The eels out here, are you eels? Scrap. So I can upgrade my ship. Perfect. It's even one more. Excellent. It's out here. Well, that was the cloth. This is the little guys, right? Yeah, these guys are really cute. Okay, it's not so cute. These upgrades done pretty quickly. Let's head over there. I think I gotta fit one more macro in there if I move the, uh, the stuff around, but not a bother. Alright, fish market. We can sell all these fish. 
We've got a surprise for you, a gift. Mostly loyal customer. Here, I want to have you to have this. The art of the silver tongue added to the cabin. She takes a book from a nearby shelf and hands it to you. Fl uh, flicking through it, you see page corners turned and handwritten notes and margins. Solid fish. Thank you. Back out of there, we'll go to the floating dock. The last piece of all done. Cool, and a new hull. Let's start getting some of this in. Our storage, we'll grab the wood. Grab the cloth. Which I have absolutely tons. Oh, I can pick that up, yeah, and I can do this. I can buy that here. Look, we can get our new thing right now. Let's uh, back up. Uh, that was the yeah. shipyard. And no damage, that's good. What's this? Pick that up. I'm gonna save that for now. It's 315, I wouldn't mind the money. Then we go back to the floating dock. 500 bucks. Okay. Let's uh, go to our cabin here and check out some new stuff. We got some stuff in the encyclopedia, the Oceanic Perch, and we got its aberration. The tiger Mackerel, it has two aberrations. We haven't seen those yet. The two crabs, they don't have any aberrations. Whaler, stingrays, sailfish. One, we got one of the flounder aberrations. We got both of the ones for the grouper. Nothing for the eel, the gray eel, I should say. We got both the arrow squids. We got one of the mackerels, and only one of the cods. We caught any of these fish. We got the two versions of the black mouse salmon. We did catch a conger eel, but we haven't. Sold it, and there is an aberration. There's a sturgeon as well. A wreckfish. And then the two kinds of crabs that are here as well. Get all back out of that. On the map. Got some stuff involved here, I guess. Probably have to do with our missions. Back out of there. Pursuits, yeah. Catch a rare fish. Okay, no problem. Find the family crest. Okay, no problem. And rotting eel. Gotcha. There's a music box somewhere here in the Gale Cliffs. Cool. And uh, messages. We got three messages in here. A note from the fisherman. Deep to sky, deep to sky, deep forever. Casket seal broken, bog core. Five equals rise, he knows. Okay. Artifact manifest. That's so the SY Grand Prize, Sir Michael Schultz, Port Gale Cliffs. Woken music box, purchased from an Aquitarian a little morrow for a bargain price, previously salvaged from an undisclosed shipwreck. Has the letter J carved on the enter side, otherwise unreasonable condition, has not been opened for fear of damaging a mechanism, pending inspection by locksmith. Wooden mass, carved, wooden tribal mass, said to bring good luck, fertility, good health, fortune, rain, and protection from evil spirits. Traded for a pair of socks with a pocket watch chain. 10 piece tea set, bone china, 6 cups, 6 saucers, acquired from an eastern dealer, do not use. A jar of earth, a jar containing earth from meteor impact site, allegedly. Fun. September 9th, 1927. He still refuses to take me aboard when he's working. He's convinced that I will find it dull and the crew will be crass or otherwise intolerable. Perhaps I am being overly needy. He needs... He knows he need. I know he needs some time alone, but I am so desperately bored at home while he is away. He recently installed some salvaging equipment 
onto the boat. I think the idea of pulling up treasure is terribly exciting. I must convince him to let me go. Fun. And we have books. Yeah, the Ark of the Silver Tongue. Let's get that going. And can I sell this? I'll go here and I go to uh, here. Ah. I'm going to storage. Can I sell any of this stuff to you? I don't want the plate or anything. I mean, no. Okay. Want this? You would take some pretend. It's not really worth anything. A weak valve engine really doesn't seem worth it. I'm just going to sell that. Basic fishing pole. Peculiar engine. Keep on that. Another stuff I don't really need. It's um a little bit of inventory management here. Yeah. There we go. Alright. Well, uh it's almost evening, but let's head out and get a little bit more fish. Just nearby. I need to drum up five hundred stuffs. for a little bit, but I'm going to cut it short again. There. Head back out. Just turn on my light. Well, there is a special fish over here. Let's see if I can zip in here real quick and grab it. say about this. Pile of loose debris. Clearing this would take some strong explosives. Okay. Light out this way. Daytime, so I feel relatively safe. Up around the island here. Some more things. 
bunch of shipwrecks here on my little island. Let's check out the island in a minute. Catherine Ring. why I got the nasty presents. Makeshift campsite. Oh, apparently I can harbor out here. That's good. will have something. I can't pick you up. I don't want claws. I guess I'll just pick up some of these little fishies. stuff here? I don't think I can. Let's rest a little bit. I see a dock over there. Hopefully we're going the right way here. Hopefully we made enough money to be able to deal with this. At the very least we got the crest for the gentleman. for the gentleman over here, and I can also grab these special fish right here. On the way. Make some a 
little bit of money off of that. I'm heading over here anyhow, so why not? You talk to the herd? Hello again. What can I do for you? Is this your family crest? You found it! I never thought I'd see the beauty again. But now, I have a further favor to ask. Would you take this to my brother at Ingfell? Tell him... Tell him his brother is sorry and would like to come home. Okay. Ah. You know, I can clear the debris around here. Hmm, you probably need some explosives to shift those rocks. My brother at Ingfell used to make explosives. For the whaling operations, you see, nasty stuff. But with the whales all gone, I can't imagine he's still in business. What else do you want to know? Let's go and talk to the guy at Ingfell. I think we'll do that in the next episode. So I hope you're enjoying the series. If you are, please like and subscribe. It really helps out the channel quite a lot. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Have a great day.